Hello guys and welcome back to another Clash Royale video. Today we are going to play 2.6 Hawk Cycle and Queen's Journey. So let's directly jump into the match and uh, let's see how good this deck works in this. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe and uh, thanks for all your love and support guys. Okay, so uh, we are up against Andretti and let's uh, activate the King Tower using our skillies. I know 2.6 Hawk Cycle will not give us uh, the Queen's ability. But I think we can win this guys uh, without it as uh, it's not that effective guys. Let's see. Uh, but it's really good against the building and I am like quite afraid if uh, it will take out my... Uh, cannon uh, against the uh, goblin uh, giant so that's gonna be the turning point for the match but i think overall we can have a really nice defense i think there was a slight lag when i placed my ice golem actually i was trying to uh, use uh, ice golem as a decoy for his spear gobs on top of his uh, goblin giant but that's okay guys we did manage to uh, do a really nice defense and i think now we can just uh, wait for elixir to fill musketeer will take uh, a good care of that uh, goblin demolisher and log will finish it off that was really nice i will go in with my firecracker to get some uh, value on top of his uh, goblin tower i think that's the name it, ha it has been given to it i think he will place his uh, goblin giant and I will just uh, use my ice golem once again. I think he will get some value. But we have our evolution skelly and the uh, activated goblin queen. So that will just uh, help us out a lot. That's really great guys. And I think we'll get some uh, multiplication of uh, skelly on top of his demolisher as well. So that was really great. Now let's uh, get ready with the musketeer guys. Let's place our ice golem to distract his uh, dot goblin and I will fireball this firecracker. This is going to be a really nice value for us. We can't afford to take any damage from the uh, evolution firecracker that can be uh, game changing. Let's place our musketeer and uh, okay actually I was trying to uh, place my ice golem but uh, I messed it up but it's okay guys let's go in with our hog and I will fireball this nice fireball for us and I don't think we will get the hog damage as that goblin brawler will not allow us let's put down our ice column I was trying to kite but that's okay guys now let's uh, just uh, try to get one hog uh, hit and I think that's uh, gonna be GG's now let's get some fire spirit value and nice log for us and let's get ready with our ice golem guys and uh, that's uh, not the best defense which we did but that's okay guys let's now go in with our hog and i will get ready with my fireball as he can place his goblin box over there okay so uh, we will get one hog hit i think okay so that was uh, not the case let's uh, put on our ice golem and uh, Let's try to finish off this game guys. Let's put in our hog. Nice hog placement for us. And I think our hog will finish off this game. That's it guys. GG's and let's move on to the next one. So we are in the match and we are up against Vegeta 9. And uh, he is uh, coming quite aggressively with his uh, goblin joint. But that's okay. We will get the king tower activation. That's what we were needed. I think uh, if we can get the King Tower activation in every matchup, then we can easily win this. We can fireball this, but uh, Musketeer will take care of that. We are low in Elixir as well, so we should be using our Elixir really cautiously. Nice Spirit Valley for us, and uh, he is giving wow. I think he didn't knew that the Spirit will take out all the goblins, but that's okay. Skellies will take care of the brawler and uh, we are chilling guys uh, Nice start for us. I think he will come in with his ability and uh, That was a nice ice golem placement, but the log did manage to get the value on top of it But that's okay guys. Let's go in with our hog 
Let's see what he will do. So he had to use his uh, goblin on the defense and that will allow us to force out the ability of the queen. And let's log this back and we are having a really good time guys. Let's kite this one. If he uses his ability then it's uh, two elixir of waste as that will not get any damage. You can see that was just a waste for him and uh, we are leading an elixir in damage everything guys i will not address the left side i will go in with uh, our hog instead as he didn't have elixir in his hand so he didn't able to place his box in time so our hog will take out that tower and we are in the one tower lead right now so he is getting quite angry now let's uh, get some evo skelly value let's put down our skellies and i think now Skelly will take care of that, but uh, I was wrong. But that's okay, guys. We have activated Queen Tower. That will help us out. Nice log value for us. He has given us a really nice value. Let's put down our cannon on the defense. And Hog is on his tower, and uh, he has to take a lot of damage over there. Cannon will take care of the graveyard as well. And Musketeer is... Uh, giving us a lot of uh, damage let's go in with our log and let's get ready with another cannon he was not expecting that i think he is in a great trouble right now as we have two musketeer coming in and uh, we can go in with our hog that will give us uh, a lot of tankier part for our musketeers and uh, that's it guys ggs and let's uh, move on to the next one So we are in the match guys and uh, we are starting with Hog and this guy have level 9 Goblin Tower. I think he didn't uh, upgrade it. That's okay let's put down our cannon and let's get ready with the Musketeer for his Goblin Demolisher that can be really annoying. Okay so uh, the demolisher will get the damage on the tower and we have hog ready let's get uh, our log ready for his princess but i will not use it right now as i want to take the damage on his tower as well that will give us some good amount of chip let's log and that's uh, really great let's put down our ice golem and uh, let's put down our skelly as well skelly will uh, take care of the spear gobs and that's uh, really nice and we are chilling guys we are in a really nice uh, position right now let's put down our musketeer and snipe that box but i think he will come in with his uh, goblin giant after that so let's get ready with the cannon so that was actually uh, a nice prediction on our part and that's really great okay so that's gonna be a really nice log value for us but i will not uh, use it right now let's uh, wait guys Let's go in with our log. Okay, so he did manage to get some damage. Then I will take it, guys. Okay, so let's uh, just uh, pressure him using our hog. Actually, I'm playing uh, really aggressively right now, and uh, that far spirit was really good, actually. Let's put on our ice golem, and uh, our goblin tower will take out his dot, and that's really great. We can take some damage from his uh, spears. And we are into XLX right now. Okay, let's uh, log this one, guys. Let's log and uh, finish off his princess as well as with the uh, spear gobs. Let's put in our ice golem. I think we have to take some damage from his demolisher. Let's log this back, guys. Okay, so he will get uh, some damage. So that's not the best defense but it will work guys as we can uh, defend his one more push and I think he will be able to do it one more time. Let's put down our cannon and let's get ready with the log. Nice log value for us. We will also get some goblin gang. Let's put down our skellies and uh, that's it guys. Uh, GG's and uh, let's uh, move on to the next one. So we are in the match guys and we are up against Claudia and uh, good luck to him. Let's uh, start with Spirit. 
and he placed his goblin joint i will pressure him on the opposite so that he can't support it using anything so he placed his dot so we will get some damage okay let's place our cannon like this uh, i'm afraid that his dot will get some damage on our cannon and this is going to be a drill one guys i think it's uh, really annoying to play against a drill along with the goblin joint but that's okay let's uh, try to win this one i think we can get him okay so we have our hog ready and uh, let's get ready with the cannon for the defense he is uh, placing his giant quite aggressively i was actually not ready for that but uh, it is what it is guys let's go in with our hog let's pressure him as well let's see what he will do so he used his drill to stop it and i think that's gonna be a really bad evo skellies our hog did manage to get two shots i will ignore them so that was not the best uh, evo skelly which we just played i think we have to take some damage and after that we can log this okay now let's log this one so not looking good for us right now guys let's go in with hog let's uh, put in our first spirit and uh, let's try to get some damage okay so he didn't have anything to stop it guys our hog will manage to take out this tower and i think uh, we can win this one now so we are about to hit 2xl let's place our musketeer from the back and uh, let's get ready for the defense guys we can't afford to lose this one okay let's uh, place our skellies so he placed it uh, right behind the tower and that will take out the skellies let's lock this one guys nice defense for us and uh, i think we should put down another musketeer i will ignore the dart and uh, let's go in with our hog let's pressure him guys i will just put everything so he placed his goblin giant let's uh, get her ready with the cannon musketry will take care of uh, the baby goblins and i think we have to stop this giant guys this is going to be really hard i think let's go in with our hog it's the last 10 seconds guys uh, we have to stop this man let's see let's see what he will do so our hog did manage to get two shots and finally he did manage to mirror his arrows so now what we can do is that we can go in with uh, ice golem and musketeer at the pocket and let's lock this one guys i think musketeer will get some damage he is not putting anything as he don't have elixir for that and i think that's ggs guys so hope you guys enjoyed the video hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more such contents guys and thanks for watching see you in the next video bye bye take care guys